Good morning, good morning, good morning. The scripture verse this morning is coming from Acts 1 and verse 8. And it reads as follows. But ye shall receive power after that the Holy Ghost is come upon you. And ye shall be witness unto me, both in Jerusalem and in all Judea and in Samaria and into the up most parts of the earth, the word of God for the people of God. This is a powerful message that Jesus is telling his disciples that they will be endued with power from on high, who is the Holy Ghost, who they will give them the authoritative power to boldly witness Christ, beginning in the Jerusalem, and we all have one in our own base, Judea, that's can spread out to our community, Samaria, Samaria and I'll spread out a little further, and even to the uttermost parts of the earth. We are to witness Christ as we as believers or his ambassadors that we are to proclaim the good news of salvation throughout the world. This is what we have been commissioned to do. And it ties into the great commission where he, he Jesus told us to, to go out into the world preach, teach, baptize him in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. And he was going to be with us. So we know Jesus is gone. He does not lie. And he is the one that died on the cross for us. And therefore, to continue spreading the good news, because it is God's perfect will that all be saved. But his permissive will, he gave us a choice. He known, being all known, that many will reject his son, Jesus Christ, and be lost. But that's not his perfect will. So in keeping with the will of God, we who are called by God as his people have been commissioned to witness Christ the world over. And I let me say this, and not saying that you're not. If we are, let us stay strong in the faith and dedicated to obeying and carrying out the commission that we have been given. And if those who are not, get, let us begin to witness Christ because the world needs to see the manifestation of the righteousness of Christ in our life. We witness Christ by our lifestyle and living a holy lifestyle. And we witness Christ through our words, telling others about Jesus Christ, who suffered, bled, and died on the cross, paying man's sin debt. Christ did not have a sin to pay for, but he paid ours and what love. And the most we can do and his expression of thankfulness, of gratitude, is to obey his commandment and tell the world about Jesus Christ and the salvation he brings through our faith in him. Like and subscribe to our YouTube channel and then become a regular subscriber to Shepherd Ministries Baptist Church. Go to our website, theshepherdministries.org, and sign up to be a regular recipient of all our correspondence, our messages, our mission, Bible study, and daily devotion come directly to your email. Thank you. God loves you, and so do I. And have a blessed day.